what's up guys i'm blank hero and that's right genshin impact will be getting their first ever collaboration with another game called horizon zero dawn i'm like it's official now they've they've leaked it themselves i'm like wow it's it's happening it's actually happening all right so if we go here really quick uh so as you guys can see here on their official hoyolab.com forum page uh we got a new five-star character that's right we're getting a free all right this collaboration with horizon zero dawn this exclusive playstation game will give us a free five-star character named alloy that is a freaking cool name all right she's uh the savior from another world all right pretty much isekai i wonder how that's gonna be integrated into the genshin impact lore i'm pretty sure mihoyo is gonna be doing something spectacular on how they're gonna implement this uh this is not gonna be until version 2.1 i believe i think it's gonna be around 2.1 so we're gonna still wait until then but you know just the fact that we're gonna be getting a new five star character for free for free is insane there's there's gonna be some criteria onto how to obtain this character but for now for context if you guys don't know what horizon zero dawn is this is pretty much it it's a playstation exclusive game it's been around for quite a while and judging by the landscape it's really cool yeah that's alloy right there and there's like these giant monster dinosaur mechanic beasts roaming the world it's a pretty cool looking game not gonna lie i might i might play it maybe who knows if i get a playstation <laughs> But yeah, that that's Ali right there. She's she's freaking cool. Love the graphics, and then you know you saw how they transitioned the art style here into Genshin. It really just suits the freckles. The has that that I don't know barbarish look. Maybe that I, don't, I think that's what they're going for. So anyway, how to obtain her? There's also by the way links to all of these will be in the description below. All right, I got you guys. So how to obtain the savior from another world? You know, again she's Cryo, as you can see. I'm like that's really really cool she's a cryo user so after the 2.1 update so at the start of the 2.2 so that's you know right now we're in 2.0 as of this recording as of this video we are on 2.0 it just started like a couple days ago uh after 2.1 so that means 2.0 has to roll out so that's six weeks and then 2.1 has to roll out at six weeks so we're expecting 12 weeks till we get the free five star character that gives everyone enough time buy a playstation 5 right or, or 4 or or go on to ebay and get like some second hand playstation for like a hundred bucks maybe maybe that that works but aside from that yeah october 13 is the date uh for all you playstation 5 4 players gamers out there you're gonna get your free five star cryo character named alloy all right but don't worry after another six weeks after version 2.2 when 2.3 launches on november 24 we already have a timeline of these updates on all available platforms we're going to be getting the cryo character named alloy for those of you who have not yet obtained don't think that you're going to get constellations on her i don't know how we're going to get constellations or how that's going to work out but if you already got alloy in 2.2 uh, you won't be able to get Aloy again in 2.3. Assuming you already claimed her to get that C1, that beautiful C1. By the way, if you guys didn't notice, because uh, I did, um, you know, Horizon Zero Dawn, right? This beautiful game did also already collab with Fortnite right here. I'm like, it's pretty cool how they did that. I know this because I play Fortnite. So yeah, that's Aloy here in Fortnite. She has that same-esque vibe. Except without the freckles, I like I like how I, I like the rendition in Genshin Impact more. I'm like that's more cutesy, more feels like. Have you guys seen um, Vinland Saga? I think that's the one, or, or Viking or something. But yeah, that that's the vibe I'm getting. So and yeah, weapon, huh? Right, you see you saw that weapon. You saw how, you saw how I transition there to this weapon. Yeah, it's free too. By the way, it's four star, not five star. It's gonna be, it's gonna be another free four star weapon. But there's there, again with 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 PlayStation, everything PlayStation. There's a caveat. All right, it feels like for this one, only PlayStation gamers will be able to get this weapon. All right, all right. But you know, it's it's a really good weapon. It scales off attack percent. Its base attack is five ten at max level ninety. 
um it's it's passive is effective for players on playstation network only so i, I don't know if you have to be playing on the playstation or you have i don't play on playstation that's why i, I don't really know how that works because i only play mobile pc but dealing cryo damage to opponents increases the characters that i'm like this is pretty much a weapon made for alloy normal and charge attack damage by 10 percent. i'm like this also gives you a glimpse on how alloy might work maybe she's a charge attack unit like ganyu who knows because that's what her weapon's saying otherwise this effect can have a maximum of two stacks actually this might even be a good weapon for ganyu all right so for all you playstation guys out there you guys are lucky all right now that i'm complaining all right i'm like i'm gonna try to find a way to get this weapon all right some way or another i have 12 weeks 12 weeks all right additionally when alloy equips predator you say that additionally when alloy that's the first weapon that is specific to a character when alloy equips predator attack is increased by 66 all right so base attack goes from 510 to 5 i don't know math 76 all right by the way guys if you guys notice something similar it's, it's the same weapon as this all right the rust at max see base attack 510 attack percent 41 the only thing that's different is the passive so yeah that this is going to be a pretty pretty interesting weapon to see and test out and to know that it actually pairs well i'm like you know it's it was made for her <laughs> specifically i'm like even in the fortnite trailer you can you can see her wielding this bow that is pretty similar right here so i'm like not as similar i guess it's it, it has the same colors but yeah enough of that that that's that's the bow so if you guys are wondering predator bow can be used on any platform but this weapon affects strong strike only applies when playing on playstation all right and then here the rules for obtaining the weapon in this event are as follows during the event all travelers who have reached adventure okay they be ar20 all right i'm guessing it's the same with alloy so if you have any um accounts that are below adventure rank 20 all right then you you gotta get it to adventure rank 20 you got 12 weeks or, or or 18 depending on on when you plan to obtain her <laughs> so um yeah so or above who log into genshin impact on the ps4 or ps5 system will be able to obtain the event exclusive four star weapon predator bow through in-game mail all right unlike with the five star character it doesn't have a phase two where on any available platform hopefully in the future we'll find genshin might find a way or this might be an exclusive thing for a playstation because i think that's you know that's that's how collaborations works i don't know i have no idea at all <laughs> in further news um we also got some official genshin impact leaks all right if you guys seen the twitter feed it's it's all over the news but here we got sangonomiya kokomi if you guys don't know her she's from this part on the the trailer right where she did this thing all right, just wait for it. The wait is over, my comrades. Yeah, that that's that's her. That that's her. All right, again, over, links will be in the description. So that is Sagonomiya Kokomi, or we all call her Kokomi, as as it was said here. She is a hydro user. She wields fish, as you can see. I'm like, I'm, I'm judging by her art style, she has this cutesy vibe, which is kind of pretty cool. Also, I noticed here that she is the divine priestess and the supreme leader of the Watsutsumi Island, right? Also, if you read further, I'm like, you know, you can read further this, but what caught my eye is this part right here. She is a tactical prowess. I right? think of her as Cleopatra. You know, when it comes to battle, trade, diplomacy, internal affairs, you know, Kokomi will do her best. And then, yeah, there was, uh, there was another thing here. Never fear, Her Excellency Saganomiya is here. That is a common popular saying amongst the people of Wata Wata Tsumi Island. Yep. So that's how broken she is. Uh, I'm guessing she's 5-star by the looks of it. She feels 5-star. She has that 5-star vibe. I could be wrong. But for a Supreme Leader not to be a 5-star, we will have to wait and see. Um, Alright, so, and then there's Kuju Sara. Alright, Kuju Sara was this girl here. Yeah, she's like the general. All right, just just let it loop. Remove all threats to eternity by order of the Almighty Shogun. Yeah, that part. Yeah, that that was a really good part. Well done again, Mihoyo. So her full name is Kuju Sara. She's the Crow Feather Kaburaya uh, Karasuno. If you guys watched Haikyuu, I, I think that means crow. I think maybe. So yeah, she is. I, I'm. I, 
I honestly feel like she'd be a five star character as well, but th that's too many five star characters. So I'm, I'm guessing she might be a four star character, maybe. Uh, please don't sue me, um, because yeah, she's a general. So you know, unlike Kokomi, she's a supreme leader, her excellency. And then, so judging by rank, me maybe she might be a four star, like you know, on on the lines of Ning Wang, I guess. By the way, what do you think her weapon's gonna be? I have no idea. Maybe Catalyst. Like Barbara, maybe. For her, we, we saw in the trailer, right? She's a bow user. So, probably another official or a different playstyle of official that's Electro. That's that's Kujo Saro. So, if you guys want to see her lore or see more of her pictures, you know, links in the description. And last but not the least, we got the booby trap. The Raiden Shogun. <laughs> Ah, these leaks that me hoyo drop. Beautiful. Thank you so much. That is... It's literally coming out. I'm like, if you guys seen this part, that this is... This is the part you want to see. Right here. I'm like, it's just... I'm speechless. I am freaking... You will be inlaid upon this statue. Yeah. The moment when... The, mo the first time... Be honest with me, the first time you saw this 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 waifu pull out that sword out of her chest, what did that make you feel? I ask you. And then they, they're they're capitalizing on the fact that she does that and she's literally everyone's booby trap. Alright, your wallets will start screaming. Alright, hopefully none of you rob a bank. Please don't. Please don't. I sure will, but please don't. Um, so, yeah, Plane of Euthymia, her eternal, her eternal, eternal ex excellency, is that how you pronounce words? Raiden Shogun, the undisputed supreme lead ruler of Inazuma. Alright, she, she shouts five star as well as Archon, so... I, I, mean, it's, I don't think it says anywhere here unless I'm blind. I didn't read it, right? She might be confirmed Archon. I don't know. But if she's the Electro Archon, I don't... Y yes, please! Yes! Freaking... Please. Wow. I don't know when she's gonna... Alright, but judging by the way things look, she might drop... I mean, all of these characters might drop around... I'm like, if that's the case, right? So we're in 2.0, right? So for Kokomi, she might be the first part of 2.1, right? And maybe the four star, I, I think highly likely the four star is gonna be, yeah, Kuju Sara. So it's gonna be Kokomi and Sara. And then on the, on the last banner, on the, the, the half or part of 2.1, we're gonna be able to pull for the Raiden Shogun herself. Yep. Yep. I think that's gonna be how it's gonna pan out before we, you know, reach uh, the anniversary. Yeah, anniversary is coming up. Yeah, before we reach the anniversary part, uh, which is probably gonna be coincide with 2.2. So yeah, there's a, there's a lot of stuff that's happening. But yeah, free five star characters. You know, confirmation on these. Yeah, it's just. I'm lost for words. I'm literally lost for freaking words. Anyway, guys, if you guys did enjoy this video, please make sure to subscribe, hit the like button, and all that good stuff. I'm Blank here, and I'll see you next time.